What's going on fam? It's your boy Baby Broly back at it with another video and today we have an epic Yu-Gi-Oh opening. Today we are going to open up some booster packs, some first edition booster packs of Storm of Ragnarok as well as Cosmo Blazer. Now before we go into the video, I just want to say if you are new to the channel, welcome and if you are returning welcome back if you don't know what this channel is about it is pretty much everything Yu-Gi-Oh related i do booster box openings pack openings new release openings as well as pokemon openings and i will be incorporating a ton of different content into this channel to include gaming mainly halo and call of duty but i will probably start incorporating different types of games depending on what you guys like to see so if you guys are interested in seeing content of that nature I do highly encourage that you subscribe now in some of my videos I do do giveaways so in this video we are going to be giving away three cards and those three cards are harpy lady sister Omega summon and DDD abyss King Gilgamesh so these three cards are up for grabs and all you have to do is obviously subscribe to the channel drop a like on the video if you guys enjoy it and to enter yourself into this giveaway and comment in the comment section below i subscribed that is all you have to do i will pick a random person in the comment section below and uh, i will randomly select that person at the end of the month as well as all my other previous giveaways so on the last video of this month i will list all the winners in a pinned comment on that video all right guys without further ado let's get straight into this opening all right so we've opened up storm of ragnarok in the past but we opened up special edition boxes that contain unlimited packs this time we're going to open up some first edition packs which is insane guys because these packs are not cheap and they are growing in price they're like 20 20 dollars a pack i believe because it's like 500 dollars or 550 dollars a booster box i actually just sold one recently for almost $500 so we're gonna go ahead and open up our first pack and hopefully we can pull something insane there is a ghost rare in this set guys so if we can pull a ghost rare Odin father of the Azir, that will be crazy but if we can pull some ultimate rares I wouldn't be mad neither I was trying to save this pack as you guys can see but I completely destroyed it so it's okay Let's see what we can pull guys. I need your luck. All you have to do is smash that like button to send us some luck. All right, we got Legendary Six Samurai, Hourglass of Courage, Top Runner, and Odin, Father of the Azir. I got scared for a moment. I thought this was going to be the Ghost Rare. So we can get a Ghost Rare of this card as well as an Ultimate Rare, but we just pulled the Ultra Rare, which is a pretty epic pull nonetheless. All right, so we're going to go ahead and sleeve that. I cannot complain. An ultra rare on the first pack. Hey, that's I'll take that. So we got Sheehan's Daredevil as our rare. Blackwing, Resonator Engine, Nordic Relic, and uh, Kagamusha of the Six Samurai. All right, we're going to go ahead and sleeve this bad boy here. What a beautiful card. Even in an ultra rare, still such a gorgeous card. All right, let's let's open in our uh, open a Cosmo Blazer first edition pack. I don't know too many cars in this set. I know there's a Ghost Rare as well, so both of these sets have the potential to pull a Ghost Rare as well as many different types of Ultimate Rares. I think the Ghost Rare in this set is the Heart Earth uh, Dragon. I don't know the full name, so <laughs> I think it's like a number C something C92 or C31. I have no clue, but uh. It's a ghost rare, all right? So we're aiming to pull that card and hopefully that we can. All right, we got Hazy Pillar, uh, Double Shark, After the Storm, Pyrotech Mech, Bruiser or Brushfire Knight, I said Bruiser. Brushfire Knight as our rare. And we got a Spellbook of the Masters and this is a secret rare. Oh my gosh, we pulled a secret rare in our second pack, as well as an ultra rare in our first pack. How crazy is that? Oh my gosh. Spellwall, Abyss Scorn, go, 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 go. So these sets are a little bit more, uh, they're a little older, all right? They're borderline vintage, depending on what you guys 
perceive as vintage i mean when i think vintage i'm thinking like legacy blue legend of blue eyes dark crisis uh labyrinth of nightmare and such but these these packs are getting older and older by the minute and they're starting to become the new vintage but wow spellbook of the masters secret rare okay i've never seen this card in my life but this is beautiful oh my gosh uh, I need to get better lighting on my camera here, my POV camera, so that way you guys are able to see the beauty in this card, because this is kind of dull, so I'll definitely fix that later. As you guys can see, I, I had to change my studio up, because I gave up my other room to my wife, so she can have an office for her uh, professional career, so I had to give that room up. Now we have this room. It's a little bit bigger, but it's a little... Uh, cluttered because i have a bunch of boxes and stuff i still need to move and clean up and whatnot but this will do for now and actually this is going to be my setting for when i start streaming all right like i mentioned i'm going to start streaming video games and i'm mainly going to stream halo just because halo infinite is going to come out i'm a diehard halo fan fun fact for those of you who follow me i'm a diehard halo fan so i'm going to stream halo uh mainly halo 3 gameplay all right so if you guys are interested in that definitely uh definitely come through and uh hang out on our streams i'm probably gonna stream either on the weekend or i'm gonna pick a pick a day out of the the weekday it just really depends i gotta i gotta figure out what my schedule is like but if you guys want to come and hang out and chit chat and see me do some gaming other than uh opening packs something a little bit different um you guys are more than welcome to come join us I'm trying to sharpen my skills a little bit before halo infinite comes out and hopefully Halo Infinite's not a letdown. All right, Yaksha, Karakuri, Vylon Matter. I need to start opening up uh, or uh, going through cards like this. I have a hard time uh, trying to mix it up. Oh, we got a Forbidden Lance, super rare for, for a second. I thought this was uh, Forbidden Chalice. But I don't think that card's in this set, is it? Forbidden Lance as our super rare. Okay. Okay. We're three for three on foils guys which is crazy because these older packs you're not guaranteed foils all right we got a tanning jostra of the nordic beast and it looks like we have a little name shift going on here it's not quite centered it's a little pushed up a little shifted up so i guess you can consider it somewhat of a name shift it's not too much it's not too distinct but hey that's pretty cool anyways six strike triple impact Worm Il Illidan, Illidan, Token Stampede, and Scrap Shark. All right, we're three for three on foils. Let's see if we can keep the streak going. Cosmo Blazer, let's go. Let's pull a Ghost, guys, or pull an Ultimate Ray or something. We need something good. Just need some. We just need some fire here. I always forget how to open up these these older packs. I'm 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 pretty sure there's an easier way to do this, and I think I. <laughs> did it at one point where i was opening them properly but i already forgot how to do it all right we got an exis remora spear shark brotherhood of the fire fist hawk exis double back behind that we have heraldic beast twin headed eagle and we have another foil oh my gosh another i'm almost thinking that these are guaranteed foils but we've opened up cosmo blazer before but in unlimited and it's definitely not guaranteed so this is crazy full of prophecy super rare guys wow zero z rock fire formation tenson pyrotech mech and that is our final card i forgot to sleeve the other two um I usually don't sleeve super rares because the super rares nowadays aren't really worth too much. So it's kind of uh, I'm a creature of habit and I tend not to sleeve up the super rares. But these are older ones and I don't know how much these are worth. So we're going to go ahead and sleeve them up just in case. And they are foils. And since foils aren't guaranteed, it is a hit. All right. All right. Third pack of Storm of Ragnarok. So far, this opening is doing pretty well, but... I probably just jinxed myself, and I shouldn't have said that. It's okay, though. I think we can save this pack. Ooh, look at that. Ooh. Ooh, look at that. Okay, this one, this one was perfect. Okay, so that means we might pull something good. All right? As I've said in previous videos, 
if you open up a pack and it comes out smooth, you're probably gonna pull something good. That's how you get good luck. All right, if it if you end up destroying the pack, you're probably not gonna pull anything that well. All right, we got a black wing, Brissot, the Tailwind, Tyrant's Tyrad, Sheen's Squire, Goddard Damarung. And we have a Nordic Relic Gun Gear. Okay, so no foil on this one because the foil comes first. Cosmic Compass. Cyber Shield. Okay, classic. Barrier Resonator. Divine Relic Jalnir. All right. We are down to our final five packs. Cosmo Blazer coming up. Can we pull that epic Heart Earth Dragon in a Ghost Rare? Or even an ultimate rare, I would not mind at, at all. Especially in first edition. It's still pretty penny. Oh my gosh. Alright, uh, your boy's struggling. Oh, there you go. That was a little bit easier. I should have just did it like that from the start. Sometimes you just can't tell with some of these packs. Alright, we've got our classic friend right here. We got Bacon Saver. You gotta love this one. Bacon Saver. Look at that. Okay. You gotta love that card. Mermel Abyss Nose. ZW Ultimate Shield. Goblin Circus. Infernity Archer. And let's see if we get another foil. Oh, we got another Fool of Prophecy, guys. We are hitting it when it comes to the foils. Oh my gosh. So another Fool of Prophecy, first edition, March of the Monarchs, Brotherhood of the Fire Fist, Hawk, and Fire Formation, Tenki. And of course, we're going to go ahead and sleeve our Fool of Prophecy here. So our second copy, I will take that. We're going to go ahead and open up another Cosmo Blazer. And uh, I want to save these two Storm of Ragnaroks for last. Oh my gosh, I completely destroyed that pack. Oh, that's terrible. That is terrible. All right. Work with me here. All right. We got Zero Z Rock. Garbage Lord. That is the title that I want. Fire Formation Tensu. Hazy Glory. Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Gorilla. And behind that, we have. Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Lion Emperor. So another foil. I'm starting to believe like foils are just given to you. I don't know. You guys let me know because I could have sworn in our last Cosmo Blazer opening. Foils weren't guaranteed. So I am absolutely shocked that we've been pulling literally all foils from Cosmo Blazer. I'm pretty sure we pulled all foils from our packs. That is crazy. All right. Go, go, go. Ghost. Leotar. And dimension game so we're gonna go ahead and sleeve our brotherhood of the fire fist here do people still use brotherhood of the fire fist i haven't heard anything about it so you guys let me know in the comment section below um if you guys play the meta do people still play brotherhood of the fire fist or is that like completely dead all right we're gonna open our last pack of cosmo blazer before we open our final two packs of storm of ragnarok here for our first card, we have After the Storm, Pyrotech Mech, Shiryu, or Shirayu, Jirak Impact, Dodo -do Bot, Hazy Flame Manticore. And behind that, we have another Brotherhood of the Fire Fist, Lion Emperor. That's another foil, guys, and another duplicate. Spear Shark. Heraldic Beast Eel or Ale and Spell Wall. So we're going to go ahead and sleeve that one up as well. I'm actually pretty baffled that we pulled all foils in our Cosmo Blazer packs. And I don't think that is a thing. So that's, I don't know. You guys let me know in the comment section below. I could be wrong. Maybe they are guaranteed. I don't know. But I know most Zexo packs that we've opened, they're not guaranteed. So I'm actually pretty surprised to see us pull five out of five foils two super rare or four super rares and uh a secret rare that's pretty crazy all right all right storm ragnarok let's pull something crazy here we had we didn't even pull an ultimate rare 
but we did pull a significant amount of foil so i'm pretty happy about that yaksha karakuri ninja mdl vylon matter tiki soul and uh watt burke so i don't think we have a foil on this one because foil would have shown up first cyber shield nordic relic drop near blackwing kalima the haze and resonator engine and for our final pack guys we need some luck here hopefully we can pull off some last pack magic and pull that epic ghost rare that would be freaking insane i'd probably run out of this damn room if we pull that ghost rare guess we'll see all right i need you guys to go ahead and destroy that like button and uh send your boys some luck and this one up opened up pretty smooth okay Whew. here we go guys <sighs> we got what mole what key memer of the nordic ascendant nordic relic lave levatin Lavatine. And. Ah. I thought I was going to be a foil. We got Ascenticism of the Six Samurai. This is a beautiful card, though. Kind of fooled me. It does look like a foil in a way, but it's not. It's just a rare. That's okay. Then we got Cyber Shield. Cosmic Compass. Six Strike, Triple Impact, and then a Worm Elidan. All right, that is our final card. So what we're going to do here is we're going to recap what we pulled. I think we pulled pretty good. I mean, to considering how many foils that we pulled, that was pretty good. So let's go ahead and recap exactly what we pulled. All right, so for our foils here, we have Brotherhood of the Fire Fist. We have two of these, the Lion Emperor. We have two Fool of Prophecy, a Forbidden Lance, Odin, Father of the Azir, Ultra Rare, and Spellbook of the Master, Secret Rare. I'm pretty, pretty stoked about this pull right here. But yeah, we pulled a lot of foils from these 10 packs. It's crazy. How many, how many foils did we pull? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 foils out of 10 packs. That's pretty insane. Once again, I don't know if Cosmo Blazer has guaranteed foils. You guys let me know in the comment section below, but I'm pretty sure that it's not guaranteed. Um, there's some rares in here that we pulled that might be pricey as well. I don't know, but I figured we just recap with the foils. Seven out of ten packs. That's pretty wild. All right, guys, that's going to end this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure you guys drop a like on the video. It will help out the channel tremendously. And as always, thanks for watching. Thank you for the support. And if you guys are interested to see me stream, I will probably be streaming this weekend, possibly Saturday or Sunday. And uh, you guys can come and hang out and watch me get my butt kicked in Halo. And we can just chit chat and whatnot. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Don't stop.